What's up, YouTube? Uh, GTO48 coming at you with a IP autograph recap. The last one was just the certified. All my certified stuff I just went out and bought. Watch that video. Oh, that's for Trader for Sale. Um, I went to the Fort Wayne Mad Ants game in Fort Wayne uh, versus the Erie Bayhawks. I didn't get anybody on Erie. I wanted to. I was going to get Keith Benson from Oakland. His towel. But uh, he threw it on the ground, and I think it landed in some water. But, um, and their their side lens was a mess. But, um, it was pretty awesome. And I was pretty happy. We went down there. I found out on Wednesday night, uh, the Pacers had sent down two rookies on an assignment for two games. And it was, uh, pretty awesome. So, you'll know who they are when it gets there. Um, but I'll just start off. The first pick in the D-League draft was Jawan Johnson and the Fort Wayne Mad Ants had that because they suck. They lost, by the way, 109 to 100. But I wanted to get Keith. Uh, nothing for the Erie Bayhawks. Keith Benson was their best player. Keith Benson or DJ Kennedy from uh, St. John's. Um, it was a horrible game. They came back, but I mean... These are cheap, and you get it's guaranteed autographs pretty much after the game. Um, I wish I was uh, still in Fort Wayne because tomorrow night Fab Mello and Chris Joseph come, so that would have been pretty awesome. But I got school Monday, and my dad won't drive me. He hey, he's got a he's got something Monday that I can't drive back late. But um, I got three of three from Jawan Johnson. Plus, I got a signed picture. My cousins really like Purdue, and they we they wanted their hats signed. It kind of, I think this kind of bubbled. This one kind of bubbled just on the. Uh, I don't know if you can see it right there, but the autograph still looks pretty nice. This one's sloppiest. Then I got an eight by ten signed. Came out pretty nice. Um. Inscribed 25, his dunk against Baylor. Inscribed 25, uh, had him inscribe Boiler Up too. The 25 and his Boiler Up. I don't know a lot of people are getting that, but yeah, this image is pretty nice. Um, so that's... Yeah, I think I got four, five, six. I got seven autographs tonight, that's not bad, but they were... They were definitely really good for a D-League game. Uh, next, I got Pacers rookie, second round pick. Uh, he's 36 overall, uh, Orlando Johnson. I know I've seen some people, uh, Cav Fanatic, he, uh, he, I, I can kind of agree with him. The Pacers are IP, dicks and IP, and uh, I got really lucky with them. Miles Plumley, he almost rejected everybody because his family was there, but then he was signing everything after. And my brother, he actually walked up and asked for his shoes, and he just smiled, laughed, and uh, he just uh, said, oh, no, I need these, which I think he'll probably end up giving them out Sunday because he's got his own custom ones. And so does Orlando Johnson, so I wish I was there and I could get his shoes. But Orlando Johnson on the uh, Prestige, this turned out sick. Um, the pace. This turned out pretty awesome. He was very nice. Uh, the story, um, my uh, cousin, he went, he was standing around talking to the court guy because they play at the Coliseum and that's where the Fort Wayne Comets play. So um, we're, he's talking with them and they go over to get their ticket signed. He's wearing a Pacers uh, sweatshirt. So uh, they walk up and uh, he, uh, they're getting their ticket signed because they had some hats for Jawan Johnson with all the team people like all the team players on, from Purdue. So they wanted Joan Johnson on their hat and he came up with a piece of paper originally. And he walks up and he's just like, oh, can you sign this? And he looks at it and flips it over. And um, he's like, I don't think I can sign this. And he's like, where's your ticket? Exactly like that. And <clears throat> my cousin goes, he's, he loses everything. He's like, I, oh, I kind of lost my ticket. And then Orlando's just like, you lost your ticket? And he's staring at him, and he, my cousin turns bright red. 
and it was hilarious. And then, um, so he decides to sign his sweat. He hasn't signed his sweatshirt, and then he's like, "Oh, now it's tight." That's Orlando. He's funny. Uh, he, my cousin, was uh, pretty mad at him. But then I, later on in the night, he was like, "I'm starting to kind of like him because uh, he actually had a conversation with me." So uh, yeah, that's I was laughing all night about that, and even this morning. Um, but. Yeah, and then the uh, best player, I don't know about the best, he airballed a uh, hook shot from about five feet away. Um, but Miles Plumley got a signed prestige card. It was, this is pretty nice. Um, turned his, it looks so much better in person. Pretty nice autograph. I don't think he's got a, he can have a sloppy one yet. Uh, he's not going to be a star, I don't think, but he's definitely going to be uh, just a nice bench player for the Pacers. Orlando Johnson, he's got the star power to make it. Um, he he was stuffing the center at playing the three spot. He was playing two or three. Um, yeah, he went up and just stuffed the center like twice. Led the uh, he led the uh, game in blocks with. Two or three. He had a great game. And then I got a signed 8x10 from Miles Plumley. This sick image. Um, perfect in silver. Uh, this is uh, the same as my Teague from the Pacers Bulls game. Uh, just Plumley's is. Uh, it's just kind of. Uh, it's pretty nice. Um. But yeah, uh, shout out to uh, Elisa J. Moskett. He got the like the same exact picture signed, except for Thomas Robinson. They uh, these pictures definitely look really nice for some of these rookies. Especially only they only did these for like first round picks, and I think two people in the second round. But that's about it. And uh, this silver just uh, prismic color. That's all I can say. That's really all I can say about this. This pen does miracles. That's all I can say. It makes pictures just flawless. That's the same for this silver. But yeah, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Um, comment, like. I'll probably do a subscriber video. So uh, yeah, peace.